Hi, I'm Mike Caffney. Welcome to the San Francisco School of Flower Design. We're located here in the San Francisco Flower Markets. <clears throat> Today, we're going to take a tour of the markets. I'm going to show you what's inside. It is a sea of flowers from all over the world. My friends come here from New York, Chicago. They cannot believe the amount of flowers we have here. So we're at the San Francisco Flower Market today. This is the San Francisco School of Flower Design. Come on in. I'm going to give you a tour of the most beautiful flowers in the world. Come on in. Ready? Hi. I'm in the San Francisco School of Flower Design today. We're at the flower markets and we stress in class <clears throat> it's a lot of economics. You've got to be a great designer, but you've also got to know how to buy and sell your flowers. So today, we're shopping at the market. We're looking for the best product out there. And this California flower market has the best product I've seen anywhere in the world. Uh, it's about <clears throat> buying the good product, uh, best product, designing it, and getting it to your clientele. Uh, today, we've got stock, hydrangeas, every flower is available to us today. Uh, it's a modern world, I tell my students. Uh, fresh flowers are flown in from all over the world. They're available at almost any time of year. And uh, it's just a matter of getting these flowers, designing them, and uh, making them look gorgeous. So today we're at the California Flower Market, so the San Francisco School of Flower Design. I'm here to pick out some flowers. We're going to do a little bit of designing. And I'm going to give you some great design tips for everyday, easy, breezy, beautiful flowers. Uh, one more thing. When you're in the flower markets, establish a relationship. Tip 1001 from my school, establish a relationship with one of the growers or the buyers here because they are your friends. They are the ones who are going to make or break you. You've got to get fresh product in for all your weddings and events. And if you have a good relationship with your buyers and your growers, they're going to take care of you. So that's my tip of the day. Get to know the people in these flower markets. Get to know the beautiful flowers and they'll, they'll make sure you get the best product. All right? This is some great kale I've got here today. Maybe we'll use some of this later on today. At the San Francisco School uh, Flower Design, we're at the flower markets here on Brandon Street, 6th and Brandon. It's a fantastic place. I get every flower I need to do all my events, all the designing. We've also got tons of uh, great orchid plants. Uh, triple Cymbidiums, $20 a pot. That is a deal. I can't believe it. These are $150 in New York City. Anyway, we're at the San Francisco Flower Market and the San Francisco School of Flower Design. And I'm shopping today. I'm going to do some uh, designing. I'm at my favorite new uh, wholesaler. It's called SF Flora here on uh, Brandon Street at the San Francisco Flower Market. So I'm going to go in there and I'm going to do some design work uh, using some of their great product. This product is shipped in from all over the world. We've got Ecuadorian roses. We've got tulips from Holland. We've got Heather from Heatherville. I'm not sure where it's from. but. Today we're going to design with some of this great product from SF Flora. So come on, we're going to meet Matthew. He's uh, one of the owners, and he's going to give us a little uh, few tips on fresh flowers. Come on in. Hey, hi, I'm at SF Flora today. Uh, one of the newest wholesalers on the San Francisco School of Farm Market. I've selected some product today, and uh, I'm going to uh, show you how easy it is sometimes to do what I do for a living, which is uh, uh, floral design all over the country. Um, I'm here with Matthew today. He's one of the owners of SF Floral Design. We're going to get some information from him on what's hot and what's coming in from all over the world. And uh, let's get started. I've selected today some hydrangeas. We've got some callas. We've got some stock. And I've got some spray roses. And I'm going to take about two minutes. I'm going to turn this into a beautiful bouquet. Uh, this is a bridal bouquet. It's for tabletop design. It's for giving to your neighbor just to say, uh, I love you, whatever. It's a great design, it's easy, it's fast, and it's quick. Ready? Here we go. I'm going to start with some hydrangeas. These are nice uh, Dutch hydrangeas, or South American. South American, yes, sir. South American. Uh, easy breezy hydrangeas. People are afraid of them. Here's some of the tips. If you want them to last longer, pick off some of the leaves, submerge them under water for a half hour. Whenever I have large events, I submerge my hydrangeas under water. Buy some alum. Tip of the day, A-L-U-M. It's powder that we use for uh, canning, for
for, uh, they, 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 they preserve jellies with it. You dip these stems in alum and put them into the vase, they turn rock hard. It makes uh, hydrangeas suck water. Again, you know my theory on flowers. Uh, they're all water with a little color on top, so I'm basically holding water right here. It just happens to be blue. Next, I'm gonna take some, uh, where are these callus from, Matt? These are actually grown by us ourselves. They're from Central California. Wow, locally grown. That's why I love California. And I'm gonna use these hydrangeas and I'm just gonna feed, how hard is that? I'm gonna feed uh, my callus through my hydrangeas. This is the look on the cover of every bridal magazine lately. And it's called, I call it a hydrangea-based bouquet. We're just gonna use it as a holder. I'm gonna put three on the inside like that. Maybe put a couple around the outside. It's the mortar between the bricks, I call it. We're going to fill in the cracks. Like that. And then we've got some stock. So I'm just going to follow that same idea. I'm going to uh, add some pieces of stock to my design. And uh, where's the stock from, Matt? The stock is also California grown. About wow. 90 cent. 90% of the product that we have here in our shop is California grown. We import a few items from South America, Colombia, Ecuador. Um, the rest is all grown by California growers. It's fresh, it arrives within a day. Um, beautiful stuff, beautiful stuff. That's why I love California. That's why I love working in San Francisco, the best flowers in the world. Notice how I funneled that uh, beautiful uh, stem of spray roses right through my design. It's really a great tip because it really holds all your flowers in place. And uh, this is how I do my bridal work. Lots of my bridal designs these days. Uh, hydrangeas are a hot flower right now. Everybody loves them. How pretty is that, right? How easy is that? As pretty as it is, it's as easy as it is. Uh, we're going to finish it off with a little bit of, whoops, pink trim around the outside. Right. It is easy, breezy, beautiful California designing here at the San Francisco School of Flower Design located in the San Francisco Flower Markets with Matt my, uh, from SF Flora, uh, wholesaler to the stars here in San Francisco. What's hot, Matt? Give him one last parting note. What, what's, what are people buying? What are they looking for here in California? Like Michael's using very popular calories. Roses are always in style. Great selection of colors, great varieties. Um, field flowers, seasonal, coming in fresh every day. Um, stop by, see us. If we don't have what you're looking for, we can find it for you. Bring it in very quickly. Yeah, you know, I talk about it in class. It's the economics of design. You've got to have a good relationship with one of these guys on the, in the flower markets. And it's a one-stop shopping. When I do my weddings and events, I don't go running all over the market. I have my buddies here at the market. I hand them my order. They take care of the whole thing. When I show up on Wednesday to start my weddings, I've got beautiful hydrangeas, callas, spray roses, stock, everything you need to get the job done. All right? So we're going to come back. We're going to do one more design from uh, SF Flora in San Francisco School of Flower Design. Thanks.